Welcome back to A Catholic Presence. Today I'd like to share with you a prayer that means a lot to me because no matter whether I'm having a productive day or an unproductive day, no matter if I'm happy or sad, upset or depressed, um, I can still offer these things up to Jesus in a special way through the intentions of our Blessed Mother. So let me introduce you to the morning offering. O oh, Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Thy Mother Mary, I offer you my prayers, works, joys, and sufferings of this day, in union with the holy sacrifice of the Mass throughout the world. I offer them for the intentions of your Sacred Heart, the salvation of souls, reparation from sin, the reunion of all Christians. I offer them for the intentions of our bishops and all apostles of prayer, and in particular those recommended by our Holy Father this month. All of our intentions can be brought before the altar, whether we make it to Mass or not, especially during these hard times, to be consecrated to the Father in union with Jesus in the most holy sacrament. And we can offer them for so many intentions, whether they're for locally, or internationally, in any way, in any prayer intention you might have, knowing that however you feel, no matter what you do, you can offer them up for these things because they are important to you. Another way that I found helpful to offer things up with the sufferings of Jesus is found in the Chaplet of Divine Mercy. When we say, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Here goes for their intercessory prayer. We can change the words a little bit and pray for somebody. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, Jesus' passion, which he endured so much, have mercy on so-and-so or on some organization, on some world news. Have mercy on them and on the whole world. And so let us conclude in prayer. In the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Dear Lord, thank you for these opportunities, whether we want them or not. The good times, the bad times, the mediocre times. Help us to know that none of this is in vain. This is all for your glory, for your love and truth, if we but offer it up. Help us to bring about your kingdom and bring that kingdom to others.